What was supposed to be a fun night celebrating Halloween turned fatal at a house party in Adams County over the weekend. Denver 7's Brandon Richard is live from the scene there. Brandon, it was just a week ago we were reporting on a weekend house party shooting also in Adams County. Here we are again now and investigators haven't arrested anyone in this case yet. Yeah, that's right, Nicole. And you know, more than 24 hours after this house party shooting, Adams County investigators continue looking for answers. And believe it or not, investigators remain on the scene here this morning. You can see that Adams County Sheriff's deputy there. Now, investigators we know spent all of Sunday out here. They were combing this massive crime scene. That scene not only includes the house where the shooting happened, but the surrounding neighborhood, including a couple of parking lots. And just taking a look around this morning, that crime scene has not changed. Now, the Adams County Sheriff's Office says that one person died. Two others were injured in the shooting around 1.30 Sunday morning. Witnesses say the shooting took place at a Halloween house party that was full of teens and young adults. Deputies took dozens of them in for questioning, and we spoke with a couple of teens shortly after they were allowed to leave. About 10 hours later, they were still wearing their Halloween costumes from the night before. They described the chaotic scene moments after that shooting. It was like really crowded. People were screaming. Like some people were like, you know, hyperventilating because they were so scared. Some, I had somebody fainted in front of me. Like it was just like pure chaos because like in that situation, like like you see it in movies, you see it like on the news, but like once it happens like in real life, like you don't know exactly what to do. You can just imagine how scary that must have been. Now, investigators have not released a suspect description. Quite frankly, they say they don't have a lot of information. One of the challenges they have is trying to track down all of those witnesses who were at the party, including people who may have left this scene immediately after that shooting. That's why this morning they're urging anyone with information to get in contact with them. We're live in Adams County this morning. Brandon Richard, Denver 7.